Hello, this is Ali from SafeNet. I'm talking here about netasp.ini. Uh, on the server where the license uh, and the net key is connected, uh, in order for the client to find where the server uh, resides, what we recommend is to uh, add a file named netasp.ini and put it on the server next to the application um, uh, directory. So where is this netasp.ini? You can find it uh, under hasp.com slash h4. I've uh, downloaded it here in netasp.ini uh, and in order to see what it includes, let's uh, have a look at it. Now uh, all of them are remarks and what we'll do in order to make them work, I will go to uh, nhtcpip and over here I will change. I will erase this uh, in order to make it uh, enabled. And instead of uh, all of this uh, sentence, I will put here uh, the number, uh, the IP of the server where the ser where the net key uh, resides. And in addition to that, I will also um, change the broadcast NHU's broadcast. I will make it disabled. Uh, and then I will save it. And this file, netas.ni, I will copy it right next to the application on the server. So any client will be able to see where the server and the license resides. Thank you for watching.